Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna be making some delicious food. Let's just get to cooking. First of all, you guys, this video is sponsored by one of my subscribers, Anonymous Guy. He's been my subscribers from long, long time ago, like a year or two, I'm not so sure. <laughs> Sorry, that was... <coughs> Anyways, today we're gonna be making the best sweet and sour stir-fry beef. Because I love beef, you can do it with chicken, you can do it with pork and other stuff. Beef is my go-to. Let's get into ingredients. 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 This is all you need, which is a lot actually. But it's a complete recipe right here. I've been doing this because my aunt made this at home all the time and it's so delicious. It's not agridulce like peruano or chifa and it's not Chinese either. Chinese usually they do it like thick and not much of the liquid. We're gonna do the liquid version because this is Thai style. Pineapple, green pepper, cucumber, tomatoes, and some meat, any type you want. Some oil, ketchup. This is for sure needed because it's gonna become one of the main ingredients for the sauce. Soy sauce, always soy sauce. Then, the real Thai cannot miss this ingredient. This thing make everything better. Fish sauce. We forgot this too. Cut, 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 cut. First of all, oil in the pan. Just medium heat. Once the oil is hot enough, when you start to see like Put some meat in as well as some pineapple. My aunt said not to be scared that this thing gonna get too muchy or something like that because we need the flavor and we also need that aroma. Like it has this unique aroma of pineapple, which I like. I have a thing for pineapple. Once you see the meat started to cook, put this in as much as you like. I put like quite a lot. <laughs> Once everything started to get like a juicing out, put in all this vegetable. Fish sauce. This one, I have to warn you, if you don't know this stuff, you smell it first, taste it first, if you actually like it because a lot of people, people who are not used to this, you may die from the smell because it's unique kind of smell as this fishy, really strong, almost like, I don't know, but if you don't like the flavor, go for some like, um, maybe salt instead. I sometimes use honey. If not, sugar is fine. Then, this secret ingredient. I usually put chili flakes, but since I can't find it around here, just hot sauce instead. Bam, bam, bam. How much ever you like it, I um, don't really actually like the vinegary taste so much. Usually, when you cook, you might need to squeeze some lime because of the sourness. This is perfect for it, so I don't need some lime. Just use this. <clears throat> On TikTok, this is this one video that has like millions of views teaching people how to cut pineapple. And I'm like, cut pineapple. So I figure out I should just put this part of pineapple cutting in this video in case some of you don't know how to cut pineapple. <laughs> The part that I don't need just yet, I usually just put it like this on the small plate or something and then keep it in the refrigerator. When I feel like eating it again, I just cut like the part, whatever I need, then continue doing like this. And... Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, big chunk. Love it like that. Also, the sweet and sour stir fry, it really goes best with omelette. Thai style omelette. Thai style omelette. Seriously, best. Cutlery, please. 
Awesome. Now we are going to in Thailand we eat everything with rice. I've actually tried it a little bit before, so I already know that it's so good. Ah with a little bit of everything. Mmm. Mmm mmm mmm. So good. Really? Pineapple. Mm. Thai style omelette, not just omelette. Meat in there. Some vegetable. This too. Big bite. Oh, oh no. easy delicious you can make it at home like really like in no time if I didn't have to film like this I would actually be able to make all this except for the rice for like less than 10 minutes or something that was good ah, this one since I film my Inca Cola video and haven't had a chance to drink it just yet because I was thinking of making some oh, Peruvian food and have this with it and then make a video but it's been like a week or so already so Why is this not like so fizzy? Fizzy, 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 fizzy. By the way, this video is not sponsored by Inca Cola. It's sponsored by Anonymous Guy, just like I said before. Thank you again so much. Thank you so much for the support. Thank you so much for watching this far. If you guys have tried making this at home, let me know. Or if you guys have any other different types of ugly dulce or the sweet and sour stir fry where you are. I know they have like so many types. This is just Thai style or just my family style that I've been eating it forever. And I like it a lot. My aunt make the best. If you guys want to support this channel or if you want to sponsor the video just like Anonymous Guy <coughs> just did. Thank you so much for watching this far. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't, 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 don't. <laughs>